this game gets wrapped up in one bow, not uh, we don't divide it in a bunch of pieces. Uh, we weren't very good. They got the win. Um, you know, we, uh, we didn't take advantage of the energy that was around us early in the game, obviously 25 seconds in. Uh, by the first time out, we were down by two. By the second time out, we were down by three, and we, uh, we worked our way back in, but it wasn't our night. We weren't sharp enough. We weren't alert. Individual miscues were uh, plenty. Uh, they were all over the board. You know, you couldn't even really shorten a bench to, to find two or three lines or get down to five defensemen. There was that many that, uh, that were airing on a consistent basis. So, um, you know, I, I think that we park it, we move on, and um, we get ready to play. They, that's a team that hasn't lost, I don't think, three times in, in a row in I don't know how many games. Uh, so for us to, to think that it was going to be a 4-0 easy cakewalk, it wasn't. And, um, you know, we're now experiencing what it's like to play um, against a very desperate, hard, hungry team. And good for us. We'll learn as we go. And we know we can be better than that. But uh, the details are going to have to get uh, a lot more polished up. Randy, uh, the, these two days in Kelowna, what do you want your team to kind of focus on? Or you just want them to kind of just get away? Well, tomorrow we'll, we'll, we'll just try to heal the bumps and bruises. You know, we felt that it would give us some time there. We could just go and relax. Uh, it's, it's more uh, for us to just kind of say exhale. We've had some very busy schedule. We're afforded the two-day two break here. We just felt that it would be better suited for our group to be in that environment, practice in the, in the Kelowna Rockets building, and just kind of take it easy. And then we'll be back here on Tuesday, uh, preparing for the game against uh, the Oilers on Wednesday.